So for me, the biggest thing to look at when we talk about end goal for backup, it's all about time too. And by that I really mean it's the time to get things done. It's the time to spin up that new application. It's the time to, you know, the time it takes you to be able to expand that database. It's the time to be able to get people the right data at the right time so they can make the right decisions. And backup is all about enabling that time too. You know, the next generation of backup, what needs to happen is each of the users in your environment, they need to feel comfortable with the services they're getting. So whether it's the virtualization team, the application team, the storage team, the end users, whoever it is, they're signing up for some sort of service level. I want my backups, I want my data at this rate. The second thing they want is they want visibility, they want transparency. After all, in our world, we're getting more and more accustomed to understanding technology and, and knowing what it can do for us. And so I know the services I want, and I know the transparency, the visibility I want into those services. And that's really what the backup team has to aspire to is how do I build out the solution so that all of those users can get the services they need while I still retain control over, yes, I am making sure that this environment is safe. It's safe, it's compliant, it meets corporate best practices, and I'm help, helping manage it not just today, but for tomorrow and the future so that everybody knows that when they need their data, it's going to be there for them. So that's really the future of backup, is solving the end user's needs with transparency, with the service levels they need, but retaining centralized control so that you know exactly where your data is, so again, people can have their data when they need it, how they need it, so they can make the decisions they have to make.